Hey guys, today I'm going to start my America haul because um, as my last video showed the CVS stuff and the stuff that I got from Quicksilver just in San Diego. Um, so I just thought I'd now start doing the big haul. I didn't get back that long ago but because I'm going to my country house soon, like in two days, and I know I need to pack and there's lots of stuff I need to do and I probably won't get around to doing it. So I'm going to do it now. And I'm going to do two boxes because it is quite big. And I'm going to be doing Victoria's Secret, Bath and Body Works, H&M Sweets and Chocolate and stuff from CVS and then Forever 21. And then the next haul video will be Macy's and Old Navy and a couple of CVS things. Um, because the Macy's and Old Navy stuff is quite long because I've got quite a lot of stuff in there. So I'm just going to dive right into it. And the first thing I'm going to go to... Oh, by the way, most of the stuff is from... Uh, the stuff that I got from Las Vegas. So the first thing I'm going to go to is Victoria's Secret. And I only got one thing from here. I was going to go, because this was like my second day um, in Las Vegas. And I was going to go again, but I never got around to it. Um, in like somewhere else in America. And so I ended up, oh, it's in the way. I ended up only getting one thing. Well, you could say two things, because they um, price separately. Oh, God. Um, and then, so the first thing I got were these, um, bikini bottoms. Okay, so it looks really blue in the, um, in the camera, but it's actually quite it's turquoise blue. It's really cute. They have the little pink heart on the back. So I got those, and those were nineteen ninety five the bottoms. And then the top is kind of, it, it, you can, like, mix and match, but I kind of, oh, what have I done? Um, it's kind of almost a triangle style. And um, it actually looks, the yellow and the blue don't look very nice at all, but it's kind of like a um, turquoise and stuff in real life. It's just a camera. And then they match together like that. And this was twenty four ninety nine ninety five. I mean. So that's what I got from uh, Victoria's Secret. Now moving on to Bath and Body Works. I was, once again, I got this in Las Vegas and I was going to go back. To get more, to get body scrub and stuff, but I never got around to it because it was such a busy holiday. So I only got like only a couple of things. So the first thing I got was a small um, Love and Sunshine fragrance, which was six dollars, and it looks like this. I wish I got the big one. I don't like the packaging on this because it makes it look like it's really sweet, but it's actually a really nice fresh scent, and um, I love it so much. That was six dollars. I wish I'd got another one. But well. And then I just got the hand sanitizers, which are five. Um, hand sanitizers for six dollars. Sadly, they didn't have Island Margarita, which I was really upset about because that's my favorite one. Um, but to replace it, they had cucumber and mint. Um, so I got the cucumber mint, which is more sweeter than it actually looks. Um, then Pure Paradise, which is almost um, coconut y, but it isn't. Uh, by the way, they're all blue and greens, so fresh scents, none of them are sweet. I then got Honolulu Sun, which is floral. That's definitely floral. Um, then it is the cool coconut colada. I don't like coconut, but this to me doesn't really smell like coconut. Um, and then my favorite one is Beautiful Day, which I just think is the nicest scent ever. So these are the five that I got. I wish I got more, but as you can see, they've changed their packaging from like the triangle kind of shapes to these circles. So. That's all I got from Bath and Body Works. I wish I got more because I don't know when I'm next going to be going. But oh well. Um, next, I've actually put all my sweets and stuff into an H&M bag because the CVS one started to break. Um, so I'm just going to dive in. I did buy a from this place called It's Sugar from in Fisherman's Wharf in San Francisco. Um, this... Um, Sweet Pizza is like a really cool shop and I just got one of those and a big box of nerds but that's somewhere in my suitcase I don't even know. So I'm just going to do the small things. So first thing I got was the chocolate fudge frosted um, pop tarts. Um, by the way, this is from CVS. I think it's from CVS. Um, I then got a packet of Jolly Ranchers. I got two packets of these. Um, and then the three other things are all Reese's Pieces. So, so I got quite a big bag of minis. I think they're much easier to eat minis. Right behind them. I then got Reese's Pizza Peanut Butter Candy in a question. I like. It sounds like they were broken over. But um, they're basically like the same size as Smarties and M&M's. Just Reese's Pizza size. 
and then I've never seen this before. This is the coolest thing ever. It is a Reese's piece of peanut butter milk chocolate bar. So it's a chocolate bar filled with Reese's piece of Reese, Reese's pieces peanut butter in the middle, and I think that's the coolest thing ever. So that is sweet rice what I got. But um, if you, I I did eat a lot of stuff there. Um, so yeah, I guess you can. I don't know what to do with the stuff, I'm just going to leave it. So yeah, I did eat a lot of stuff, and my brothers and stuff are carrying stuff that we're going to share. So moving on to H&M. So, I know in H there's a loads of H&Ms in England, but I just thought I'd have a look. And they had stuff that I hadn't seen before, and then um, uh, stuff that I had seen, but like, let's say it was 14 95 here. It was also 14 95 there, so you still save money, which is like 11 dollars pounds or something 10 pounds so i only got two things um and oh i only got two things especially because the other stuff will be coming out in england so i only got these things because i really cute like adored them so first of all is it's this cropped um kind of hunter green uh i don't know what you call this they don't obviously don't don't say what it is but i just top <laughs> basically that comes in in the waist um uh and then comes in on the sleeves and I just thought it was really really nice and it looks nice with a dumb skirt or whatever and this was twelve ninety nine, and this is extra small it's also really nice and flowy um, they had it in black and burgundy but it just got in this colour and then the other thing I got was this top which says Raymond's on it a black and loose like that which I think is really cool and that was fourteen ninety five, I think yeah, fourteen ninety five. So those are just the two things I got from H and M because I didn't really want to spend my money in there um, when it will come out soon, if, it, if not already here in England. So yeah, um, moving on to my last uh, shop bird visit for this haul that I'm going to be doing, and this is the Forever Twenty One. I'm really disappointed in myself because um, the Forever Twenty One in Las Vegas was the flagship store. It was huge. I was dying in there, and we didn't have enough time just to buy loads. I went in there quickly, basically just looked on the top floor. When I, I mean, looked on the bottom, looked upstairs quickly, but mainly just went down. And there is this grey jumper that I bought, um, which is so nice. It's a little zip here, um, hood, and I wore it on the plane and everything. It's so nice, but I don't know where I put it because I've been wearing it today. But if you search it up. I'll try and link it down below. Anyway, um, so that's not in the haul. That was twenty four ninety five. If you remember correctly. Um, so the first thing I got was this small top. Oh, let's see. I got it mm, more like wintry colours. This even though this isn't a wintry top. This is uh, just I don't know what you call them. It's almost like a tight crop vest thing, which is an Aztec print on it in these kind of darkish colours. That I think are really, really nice. And this was so cheap. Like this was. Six dollars ninety, and I think it's just really, really nice. So I got that um, from Fab Twenty One, obviously. And then the only other top I got was this. I'm so happy with this. It's almost like jumper ish, but in winter I love these colors. Like I think they're called turtleneck colors. Um, and it looks so red in the camera. It's actually this kind of dark and mustardy green color with these ridges in the middle and I think it's so so nice I love these I have so many of these from Topshop um, and this was only $12.90 which is like really cheap it looks really small um, but it like stretches quite far this was extra small I think size yeah that's what I got and then I only got a two little bit from Bob's I got these really cute um, socks which I thought were like cute little momentum which are the um, I, my mum calls them, um, shoe liners because you can't see them above your shoe. I just call them ankle socks. Um, so yeah, got those. They were non $1.90 with stars, like American flag. And then I love scrunchies a lot. And I wish I'd got another one of these. This is just their Aztec print, um, hair scrunchie, which looks like this, which matches like the top, um, almost. And this was only $1.90 as well, which is about one pound, one pound twenty. Oh no, fifty. Yeah, about one pound, one pound twenty. So that is all that I got from Forever Twenty One. 
ne the, like I said at the beginning of the haul, but I thought I'd just remind you, next time it's going to be Old Navy and Macy's, which I did mash a shop on. A ridiculous shop. Let me see. Oh, I think I showed you um, my Ghirardelli stuff, um, which were these three powders in my last video. Um, so I won't show you them now. Basically, if I didn't, I can't remember. They're just chocolate powders for cooking and drinking, and I just thought they were so nice from Ghirardelli. And then I got one other thing, which I didn't show. No, I didn't show. And it's this beautiful tin, which is for hot chocolate, and it's chocolate drops. So basically, they're and basic kind of like chocolate chips, and you melt them into hot milk. I think it's a really rich um, hot chocolate. And I thought the tin was so cute. And then when I finish with the like chocolate drops, I can fill this up with my hot chocolate. Um, if you don't know what Ghirardelli is, it's basically a really nice chocolate company that was founded in San Francisco, which is where I just came from. So that is the end of this haul. I hope you enjoy it. And I'm going to be showing you the next one. It'll probably be up tomorrow or something. So yeah, uh, have a great day and I'll see you soon. Bye.